Not gonna lie, that scene made me jump. Hello everyone, my name is Enzo Macarone and this is Pop Culture. You have no idea of how much this band has been recommended to me. So my friend, who also recommended Falling in Reverse, which ended up being a great band with a great song, also talked to me a lot of times that I should listen to Bring Me The Horizon. And she showed me a very old song from them that she likes. But now I know that they are going to release a new album soon for Halloween, so I wanted to react to one of their newest songs called Teardrops. I have more or less an idea of what it is the song about, but then I'm going to analyze the lyrics to understand it better. If you happen to like the video, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to the channel because I'm gonna keep reacting to the best hard rock, rock, punk, metal bands from all time. Because as I'm a pop head, I have missed out a lot of great music from all ages. So I need to mend my mistakes. Teardrops. I already know I'm going to love this song. So before he goes to the rest of the song that is missing, uh, well, I can see here a reference to the Joker uh, from Jared Leto, but here I think he is showing all the vices uh, that people with the problems that he's talking about, uh, many people end up uh, taking these vices. This song is so incredibly good in a musical way that I, I can't stop moving and enjoying the music but I also uh, I am aware of how the terrible and how painful the lyrics are. Not gonna lie, that scene made me jump. 
<laughs> I was not expecting that, man. If you saw me make some strange gesture, it's because I think the song was already very, very good. It had a lot of elements that I like in music, but when it was ending, they added this part and the song turned epic. Pauses. How I miss pauses. Music before used to have pauses. And you know, it gives you a time to process what you are listening to. It's like time stops and I think that the slow motion in this part is perfect. So then when the song starts again, you have built up all this energy from the pause. And you know you are going to enjoy when the music starts again. This song has a lot of elements that I like. I don't have a lot of musically technical vocabulary because I'm not from the UK or I am from Argentina, this is not my native language, so I don't have a lot of vocabulary that I would need here to use to express myself. One of the things that I like the most about this song is the use of, I don't know if they are keyboards or synthesizers that make that sound Ta -da. and especially when they change the rhythm. Ta -ta 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 -ta. I love that part of the song. His voice, very strong, very powerful. He expresses the pain, the suffering with his voice in an excellent way. You can hear all the instruments in this song. One of the instruments that stand out the most are the drums. I really like how the drums sound in this song. But you can also hear the guitar, the bass very clearly. I think one of the words that represent the most this song is fusion. I like how they fusion a lot of, how they mixed a lot of rhythms. Amazing, just amazing. So once again, my friend was right. I loved this song. I really, really liked it. And I love that these bands are keeping metal, hard rock, and metal core, all these genres that I loved when I was a young boy in the 2000s. And they keep them alive. And I think there are a lot of good songs new bands, new songs coming out and I think YouTube is being a platform 
where you can get to know a lot of bands that nowadays you wouldn't be able to do it because there are no more record stores and music has changed the world has changed now we have youtube to know these great bands talking a little bit about the lyrics uh, i don't want this video to get in very long but uh, i uh, think the lyrics are very interesting because the singer is talking about all the problems that come with fame with uh, being in the spotlight i think it's it must be a terrible pressure a terrible feeling because you are always being watched because you are questioned uh, people sometimes are mean uh, and you get a lot of anxiety i think so he talks about being anxious uh, feeling depressed and sometimes recurring to drugs to try uh, and calm down a little bit but you know drugs always come with a price they have a, a lot of problems attached to them and so if you are using them to keep you calm to not think about your reality they can be very very dangerous so the lyrics of the song are very painful are about suffering you know the musical part it's beautiful and you want to enjoy it but the, uh, we also have to remind that the lyrics talk about a serious subject and i hope he's better now he can uh, overcome these problems i wish him the best and all the the members of the band i wish them the best because i want them to keep making great music check out in my channel the halloween special with the best six soundtracks from the rio argento's movies the master of horror he also loves to mix a lot of music musical genres opera with metal with rock with horror music so perfect now that i have reached 100 subscribers i'm going to make a video of the 10 best hard rock and metal bands from argentina then i when we reach 200 i'm going to make the 10 best pop punk and rock bands from argentina and i also do other types of contents like reviews unboxings hauls i talk about movies i talk about anime manga everything this is not only a channel for reactions thank you very much for watching the video if you happen to enjoy it don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to the channel if you want to keep uh, seeing more reactions to the greatest bands of all time hard rock rock metal the best of the best the songs that i have missed out because i'm mostly a pop head but i enjoy this music see you in the next video goodbye